As the chase ensued from the north, HMS Duke of York and the light cruiser HMS Jamaica approached from the south with four destroyers, and taking advantage of the Scharnholz's blindness, encircled the battleship in a pincer movement. At 16.47, HMS Belfast fired star shells and lit up the dark sky, turning night into day. At this very moment, HMS Duke of York fired a full broadside and smashed Scharnholst's forward main gun batteries. Scharnholst fired back with her sea turret, but her shells missed. Trapped, Scharnholst turned east and continued her dash, still firing with her only operating turret. Her superstructure was beaten heavily, but her thick belt armor was resisting the hail of British shells. However, one shell from the Duke of York penetrated the top armor belt and knocked out her engine room. At this moment, four British destroyers closed in and carried out a torpedo attack. Yet Scharnholz prevailed again and managed to increase her speed back to 22 knots. 